Hello there! If it's your first time visiting the channel, thanks for watching, welcome. So no waffling from me today, let's get straight on with it. Today's video is about... So in this, which is part three of teaching yourself ventriloquism, we're going to be looking at the letter F. I feel like I'm in an episode of Sesame Street. So how do we say the letter F without moving our lips. So when you say the letter F normally, we use our bottom lip on the bottom of our top teeth. Go, F, 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 F. So the substitution we use to create the sound is a TH sound. So we say F. But what we're gonna do, as I've discussed in previous videos, we put our tongue at the back of our front teeth doing the th, 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 th sound. But we push air through and soften the TH to make it more of a th, th, as you can hear there. So I go th, 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 So it sounds more like a F. So you push a bit more air through and soften the TH. So you're saying a word like fair, 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 fair. You can hear that we're getting closer to what we want to achieve, or fair enough. Even the enough has a, a th sound at the end. So it's, it's a good one to practice. Fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. There is another way you can say an F without using the TH substitution, and that is pushing air through your lips. So you, so, so you get a F sound like that. This is me exaggerating it for you. F, F, F. The only thing with this is you can see your lips slightly move and, and your cheeks because of that burst of air. But if you can soften that technique, uh, this is, let's try the word fair, okay? This is it with a, a TH sound, fair. And this is using the, pushing the air through your mouth, fair. Okay, I'll do it both ways. TH, fair. Uh, pushing the air out, fair. TH, fair. Pushing the air, fair, fair. Okay, so they're, they're, they're both valid ways. It depends which one you feel most comfortable with. You might find one sounds better or uh, and is easier with your lip control. Um, just pick whatever's best for you, okay? Now, there's some words that are quite difficult to say with, with an F, particularly ones that start with an F-R sound, a fr, like from, frog. They're quite hard to say. So, uh, throng, throg, throng, throng, throg. Because of that TH, you get throg. So you, you've got to really work hard on softening that TH to get it closer. But you can use that. This is when that pushing the air through substitution can work. Throg. This is like with the TH, throg. This is with the air, throg. And I'll do that with from. TH, throng. Uh, pushing the air, throng. So there's those. And here's... Uh, a good tongue twister for you to use, and this is a toughie, it's, uh, I've got it written down, <laughs> here we go, five frantic frogs fled from 50 fierce fish. Five frantic frogs fled from 50 fierce fish. So the words in that are difficult to say, are frantic, frog, and from, they're the toughies, okay? And you'll notice this more when you're using your normal voice time to say them rather than your character voice. So five frantic frogs fled from 50 fierce fish. So I'll try and say it now using the TH substitution in my normal voice. Five frantic frogs fled from 50 fierce fish. It's quite a tough one. This is me doing the TH substitution with my puppet voice. Five. Five frantic frogs fled from 50 fierce fish. And now I'll try both using the blowing the air sound. Okay, here we go, my normal voice. Five frantic frogs fled from 50 fierce fish. And then in my puppet voice. Five frantic frogs fled from 50 fierce fish. As always, Remember, teeth together and lips slightly apart so you can make these sounds. 
okay? Practice these F sounds always in front of a mirror and above all else, have fun, okay? It's a crazy thing to do ventriloquism, so we might as well have fun doing it. If it's not fun, then what's the point, eh? So thanks ever, ever so much uh, for watching. Please uh, subscribe, click the notifications bell so you know when more lessons and videos are coming your way, and like and share. I also do online ventriloquism lessons over Skype. If you'd like one-on-one -on -one tuition, just get in touch. There's an email below in the video description. And that's it for now. I look forward to seeing you again soon. Bye.